Hi friends and welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited that you're here today. I actually heard, I asked for you to voice your opinion and I heard it. So on my last Lululemon versus um, Aloe Yoga legging video, I asked you guys to let me know if you wanted to know a little more about their biker shorts, which to me, they're a must over the spring and summertime. I'm always on biker shorts, not only to the studio or the gym, which I, I honestly rarely wear them to the gym and to the studio. I love them as lifestyle pieces. And so I am styling them here for you today in a few different ways. So just to show you how they can work um, and still look chic and put together, you know, it's not just like a, I don't know, a sporty item. And I'm also going to be talking about the differences between the aloe yoga shorts versus the lululemon shorts so right now i am wearing the aloe yoga in the black i also have them in white and i absolutely love them they're not see-through at all like the fabric is so thick and i love the length of them and i'll be showing you on the body this is the lululemon aligns so the aligns if you guys watched my video my previous video on the leggings you will know that they are different than the other styles. They are more of like a stretchy fabric. So they are a four way stretch, which means they're really pliable. They're really, really stretchy. But for the biker shorts, they're double lined, especially in the um, white. And I totally appreciate that because we do not want anything being see-through. So highly recommend either one that you go with. You won't be sorry, you guys. I do have the aloe for a couple of years now and they resist the time they wash really really well the lulu is a very new addition for me so i can attest to how long they will last and if it like washes well i did have some makeup on and so they're like really stained right now so i haven't even washed them once so I, I won't be able to attest to that but i can tell you that i have a lot of lululemon other stuff you know leggings and they do wash and last for a long time. The one thing that I love about Lulu's a little more than the aloes is the fact that they have different lengths that you can choose from. So with the aloes, you have the shorts or the, the biker shorts, you know, the Bermudas kind of like style, which is like a mid thigh. With the Lulu's, they have in like three or four different lengths and I will try to find a little picture in here and show you guys different lengths that they have. And I'll also leave the Aloe Yoga versus Lululemon leggings a video down below the link so you guys can check it out. If you haven't seen that yet, super helpful. If you guys are trying to decide which you know legging to go with, I realize that there's a ton out there and it's just really overwhelming. So hopefully this video will be fun for you guys to see how you can wear your biker shorts outside the studio and still look chic and put together. Okay guys, so are you ready to do this? Let's do it. Okay guys, so for the first outfit, I am wearing the Lululemon half zip up uh, pullover with the Aloe Yoga biker short. So the biker shorts is um, high waist biker short it is made with their signature lifting sculpting airbrush fabric. So they are the same ones at the airbrush leggings I talked about on the video of the leggings. They are super high waist, they are moisture wicking fabric, this technology, and they are a four way stretch too, which means it moves with you. It's just very, very stretchy, pliable, just allows for a lot of movement, which is perfect for you guys. If you guys travel a lot, I won't recommend them for flying because it gets cold on the plane, at least for me, but they're definitely amazing for road trips. And this half zip up, it's made of a texture cotton. I, guys, I love the detail of the half zip because I feel like it looks good in the gym and outside. It's just a very chic style of pullover. And I think it's just, it doesn't look sporty at all to me. It looks like just a gorgeous pullover. I love the fact that you can cinch the waist and it is like this lace. It looks like a thick shoelace. It's just really nicely made. It has this metal detail on the shoelace. So it just makes it a little bit more elevated. It is an elastic cuff in here as well. And it does have 
have a little concealed zip up pocket on the side which is perfect if you guys are just running to the gym and you just want to stick in your cell phone or your wallet your credit card or whatever it's just a really really nice pullover and it does come in three colors for the biker shorts it comes in six colors this particular one I have the white and I have the black one and you guys I'm also styling the this one look with my Zara sandals which you can find the link on the Zara haul my latest Zara haul I also found a super similar style here that comes in other colors too just in case this kind of like taupey color is not your thing but if you do want this exact ones go check out my video at the Zara haul the latest one okay guys for the second outfit wearing the same black aloe yoga biker shorts I am styling with this Lululemon cropped a uh, little jacket here. This the name of this guy is Serve It Up. So I'm guessing it is a um, jacket for like tennis. You know, my daughter plays tennis, so I'm I'm guessing she's gonna be stealing this sooner or later. But what I love about this jacket, is, first of all, I don't have a little black jacket that's like sportier, um, like this one. It's like a really thin fabric, but I love that it has this like sheer or mesh. Um, fabric on the underarm in here you guys this is perfect for like outdoor sports you know if you're walking even in the heat you know it, it gets like the sweats to be passing through and then you guys are like not burning your skin I'm obsessed with this jacket I think that it's such a great addition if you guys are into sports but you can definitely style it to go out or to you know go from the studio to the grocery store or run errands or whatnot I, I don't see this as being like super elevated like but you can definitely throw in with a little denim uh, like if you're wearing jeans and maybe a tank top you can just toss this over and maybe some sandals i can see it going for like an outside look but not super elevated like i saw the pullover you know being a little more dressier that's what i'm trying to say so this guy here is definitely more in the sporty vibe but can definitely be worn outside the gym so just styling with the Spanx this uh, sports bras are Spanx and I love all the Spanx active line actually you guys I have a discount code it's Karina X Spanx gets you 10% off anything on their website if they're having like a big store-wide sale they the coupon code won't work but other than that it should work at all times so I'm gonna make sure to leave that down in the box below for you guys to always access I do have some of their leggings do let me know if you want to know more about Sphinx active wear because I do have almost their entire collection and it's just really really good I have this uh, sports bra in several styles I'll show you what it looks like on the back it's just a really good racer bag it does not have any padding on which to me I like it better without the pad but it does have like reinforced seams and it just lifts it up without adding the bulk if that makes any sense so styling this with the balenciaga chunky sneaks that i love so much i'll try to find them somewhere in stock for you guys and the balenciaga men's belt bag i love this belt bag because it fits just about anything it is men's and i don't know why they would think the man needs to have bigger things than girls it could be because the men men are built differently and that's why they have like a bigger belt bag but us women have so much more to put in our bags so i love this one menswear bag to go everywhere super cute to wear like as a crossbody as well so super super versatile I think that's it for this outfit okay guys so for the first look with the, the white biker shorts is I'm bringing the best seller jacket for the whole Q4 last year is also a Lululemon find and it's back in stock I am so thankful for that because you guys have loved it it's such a great jacket it's definitely a staple whether you are a hiker you are a gym goer or just for life period I actually just told my friend she had a little hiking trip to some trails in the Appalachian Mountains and I'm like, you have got 
to get these because she's like what should i bring you know i need a jacket but i don't want to be like a nice jacket because i'm going to be trailing but i also want something that i can wear you know not just on the trails um and i'm like you have got to get the always effortless jacket from lululemon so okay what i love about this first of all this color is called trench um so it's just a great basic uh color it is more of like a trench coat so staple color that everybody needs in their wardrobe i am showing here on the video a few of the designs details there's like concealed pockets so it's definitely very functional and I love that it has like a hoodie rolled up in the collar in here so just secured by a button I love this jacket it does have a little bit of an elastic here on the cuff and it's double lined so it's a warm jacket as well you want something that's functional but it's also going to keep you warm but it's not like an extremely like uncomfortable warmth if that makes any sense it's just gonna it's a windbreaker so it's it doesn't let it penetrate the wind and it's also waterproof which a lot of the Lululemon jackets are so it's great too if you are hiking outdoorsy doing some stuff outdoor and there's a light rain it will keep you protected with the hoodie on and everything so I wanted to style this in a way that can be worn like I said a little more elevated a little more to run errands and so therefore I'm pairing that with the YSL tribute sandals which to me are some great staples the collar cognac just goes with everything so just put a, a basic top here this is like a little tank from top shop so little cheapy one that everybody needs in their wardrobe and I am adding on the newest addition on my bag collection you guys I haven't even introduced her here on the channel yet this is the first time you're seeing her it is the Dior Bobby medium in cognac you guys I love this bag so much I have worn it like countless times already since I got her a couple weeks ago so do let me know if you guys want to review on the Bobby like my thoughts my personal review on it I there's tons out there on YouTube so if you've seen it off of her totally fine but if you guys want to see my take on it and what fits in it I'll be more than happy to review for you along with showing you some ways that I have been wearing her including with this so this is more of like a sportier look but you can definitely elevate it with a piece of designer bag a statement shoe or something like that so this is it for the third look okay guys and for the last look i wanted to mention is a way to elevate any types of biker shorts is to have like a nice elevated graphic tee so any like designer graphic tees or things like this you know like if there's a brand logo obviously you can find those things now on amazon all over so you don't have to spend on an arm and a leg but that is just a really quick way of elevating any bottoms that you have so including biker shorts just by wearing these i hope that you guys can see the fit that's just really awesome and impeccable like great little lift on the booty you know just like the alo yoga these are just softer on the body so the lulus have that added softness compared to the alo yoga shorts but you can also see here on the lulu leg or the lulu shorts that they are not see-through either so you can safely go with either the aloe or the lulu you know safely that you won't be showing off or flashing anybody with the white ones so feel free to go either way either brand is just perfectly fine i also wanted to touch base on this denim jacket this is an abercrombie find so under 90 dollars i believe i think it's 89 dollars everything fits true to size for them so this is a size extra small i just really like how simple the silhouette is i love the concealed zipper in here it's just like a cooler style it's got like a crop length inside pockets but it's just very minimalistic denim jacket so if you do like the denim jackets look but doesn't like all of the add-on like pockets and things like this this is just a lot more simple style and then I'm obviously getting all my golden goose because I feel like they also go with anything and they also elevate any like sportier style but also adding my Gucci mini bucket because that is just something that's a little more dressy so you can definitely wear this look to go run errands or you know do whatever you want during your day that's just a little more casual but you're still looking good put together and that's all I'm about so you guys I hope that this video was helpful to you 
helps helps you to visualize how you can wear the biker shorts outside of the studio or the gym obviously they are amazing for a hot yoga session you know during the summertime so you're not like totally melting inside but i love wearing my biker shorts outside the studio even better if you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful please let me know and leave me a thumbs up or leave me a comment down below and let me know what you want to see here next i'll see you next time um beijo tchau tchau